Mm -hmm. All right, today we're at the world headquarters for health and wellness in Catanning, Pennsylvania at Mills Chiropractic Center. So this is our next episode of Living Wellness Chiro Mills Chiropractic Stop. So I want to go over with you a, a common mistake I see people make when they're trying to transform their lives and live a healthier and, uh, and better life. And what that is is this, is you know people come in and they start getting adjusted and they feel better and they live without pain. Um, they have more energy and they become excited about making changes in their life and, and we support them in that and we help them in that. But one of the things we see people do is they, they oftentimes start by eliminating things. You know, they'll say, okay, I'm going to eliminate cookies or pop or whatever. And, you know, maybe those are good things, but we don't suggest that people start there. We actually suggest that people start by adding good instead of subtracting bad. No one likes to feel deprived. No one likes to feel like they can't have the things that they find enjoyment in. And a lot of people associate enjoyment with foods that maybe aren't necessarily uh, the healthiest foods for them. So rather than tell yourself that you're going to eliminate all these things that you love and you have emotional attachments to since childhood, what we're going to do is we're going to add the good. So we tell people, hey, could you, you, know, could you add two glasses of water to your day? And let's do that for a couple weeks. Could you add a raw fruit or a vegetable with each meal? You know, if when you wake up in the morning, could, could you cut strawberries up and put them on top of your cereal? Could you, could you have a handful of grapes? Could you maybe throw in some carrots with your snack? See, we don't tell people you can't do this and you can't do that. We say, add these things in. What starts to happen is over time, as you continually add some vegetables to your diet and add some water to your diet and, and do those types of things, then really you start to see things subtracting naturally and you don't feel deprived and you don't feel like you can't have these things, you don't binge and go back. It's more natural, it's a more healthy way of going about it. And it's really been very helpful for me, even in having children, you know. Start out, you say, well my kids eat this or they eat that. Well, okay, well, hey, you know, if they love pizza, could get, get them to eat some sort of a fruit or a vegetable first. Try to get them to eat a salad first. And then increase the size of the salad over time and what will happen is the, the amount of pizza will decrease and they'll get more nutrient dense, healthy food into their their diet and less unhealthy food into their diet. So that's your tip. So what are we saying? We're saying, listen, we know you're getting adjusted and your spine's healthy and your subluxations are corrected and your nerve system's working better and now you have more energy and more enthusiasm for life and you're feeling good and you're living without pain. You say, I want to do some more stuff, Dr. Mills. Well, good. Add in the good. And it just doesn't have to be nutrition, right? I mean, it could be adding in five minutes of walking. You say, well, five minutes of walking, that's not very much. Well, if you did five minutes of walking seven days a week, that's 35 minutes of exercise you wouldn't have got. So let's add these things in. Let's make some changes. We'll see you again on another episode of Living Wellness, Mills Chiropractic Style. Have an awesome day. Get well, get fit, and get adjusted. Take care.